They keep hating, but still watching. Check the boys, I'm still topping. Hey guys, welcome and welcome back to my channel. Um, excuse the way I sound. I am sick. I the girls were sick last week, and I had a little bit of the, the symptoms that they had, but it wasn't nothing too crazy. But it's like now everybody is getting better, and now I'm getting worse, I guess. So last night well yesterday i started sneezing a lot and but it's like a dry sneeze it hurts and then like you know my throat is itchy and i'm not really stuffy but um just a lot of sneezing and coughing and throat aching so i'm here trying to drink this coffee it doesn't even taste good i'm not even enjoying it but you know i have to have my coffee but i might have to make me some tea because my coffee is not cutting it <sighs> i also have a doctor's appointment today so i'm like half ready i showered um i did my brows i got a retwist yesterday so i gotta do my edges and stuff and try to style my hair but other, and find something to wear. I'm just here in my robe, um, dealing with the kids, about to see what they want to eat for breakfast. And then I'll eventually be getting dressed to go to the doctor. Um, everything is okay as far as the doctor. I just have to get my birth control. I get my birth control every three months. So it's time for me to get it again. It's that time. So yeah, hopefully I'm not there long because I they'll leave you sitting in the waiting room for like 40 minutes and then they'll pull you back to your room and leave you sitting there for like another 40 minutes. And that's just like an hour and some change out of your life just waiting. So I'm not doing that today. I have to get back home and get Lily um, before she... No, absolutely not. You're not doing that. We're not doing that. Anybody else's kids is on a thousand at like seven, eight o'clock in the morning. Like, it's a lot. Pray for me. Pray for me. I'm gonna drink my coffee and see how I feel. I will be back. I need to figure out how to style these locks. Um, I kind of want to do like since it's parted this way. You know how they do like those cornrow looking things. So I will leave that like that and do that cornrow going like that. And then I would do this one, you know, going like that. It's like a, a roll type of thing they do with locks. You're not going to corn roll it, but you're going to like, I, maybe I'll do it on camera with y'all. I got to watch a couple of videos and see how to do this, but I kind of just want to style my locks. Um, they're not long, like how I want them, but they're getting heavy. And I, I did always want them to get heavy and have some weight, you know, like. I was not always able to do this. So, I'm gonna appreciate the length I do have and just, you know, move on with my life and worry about something else. But I'll be back, guys. All right, y'all. I drink my coffee. I'm actually still drink. I'm all on my second cup. Um, I'm not gonna drink any more coffee because it doesn't help when you're stuffy. You should just drink tea and, you know, Tea and cough drops would really do it for me right now. So I'll probably try to grab some when I'm out. <sighs> I'm tired and I feel weak, but my kids have so much energy, so I have to be up. I wish I could just lay down and go to sleep and sleep off and sleep off of this, you know, sickness. I don't know. Get some type of rest. Mm -hmm. But. I guess I'll rest when it's time to go to bed. <sighs> I'm about to get them washed up and stuff. And I'm about to start getting my stuff ready to go to my doctor's appointment. Sorry. Again, my voice is cracking. It hurts when I talk. So this little girl, she kicks the camera all the time. It hurts when I talk. So just bear with me. And yeah, if I go out, if I crack, you know, you see some tears rolling down my face. I'm going through it right now. I make it look like I'm not, but I am. I am. I just want to rest. I just want to lay down and rest. <sighs> I wish I had somebody come help me with the kids, but 
my mom is already gonna sit with the kids while I go to the doctor. So I am appreciative for that. Cause you can't bring people in the doctor's office with you still. Like you still have to go in there by yourself. Or else I would have set that stroller up and had them right on in there with me. Right there, iPads, you know, but we living in a different time right now. So <sighs> kitty's gotta stay home. Update, life update. I'm still sitting here trying to get it together, y'all. I have not even budged to wash anybody up or do anything. Um, I just finished breastfeeding Taylor and I'm just, I have no energy. I don't know how I'm about to make it through today. I really don't. I don't know. I should have done my Sheen haul. I'm supposed to do a Sheen haul for you guys. Because I, I want to wear one of the outfits to the doctor from the, um, you know, my clothes. And I haven't done my haul yet, so I don't really want to touch the clothes. But they're all comfortable clothing. And I want to put on something comfortable right now. But I'm going to be loyal. I'm going to be loyal. i probably do my haul today when I get back. So next time I decide to step out, I could be comfortable. Because I don't feel like getting dressed today. I don't feel like doing anything. I don't. I don't, I don't even feel like, I don't even think I'm putting any lashes on today. I don't know. No, I don't think, I don't know. I might, I might not. I'll, I won't come back on this camera until I pull myself together. Yeah, I won't see me again until I'm actually together. I promise I will not pick this camera up until I am put together. All right. Today has got to be one of the most craziest days. So you see, I put my lashes on and I did everything. I did my hair. I, I did not get dressed because before I could get dressed. Um, so my prescription, I'm supposed to pick up my birth control from the pharmacy before I go to my doctor. And I've been trying to get this birth control for two days now. And the pharmacies, even from different pharmacies, Pharmacy's been giving me the runaround saying that they don't have it in stock. Call the other pharmacy, see if they got it in stock over there. So yesterday, they told me they was going to have it in stock at one pharmacy. So we went over there to get it and they don't have it available. It's out of stock. So they were supposed to have it. They actually called it into the other pharmacy and said that it would be ready yesterday. Um, but we didn't go back yesterday. So an attempt to go back today well we're gonna go back today but we decided to call so they don't have it in stock they don't have it at all even though they said that they were gonna have it yesterday for sure come back and get it yesterday it's a whole nother day and they don't have it um so now i have to reschedule my appointment and i've been on a i called i've been on hold with them for like for 30 minutes um i think they're on lunch break so I am going to give them a call back in a little while and reschedule my appointment because I don't know when I'm gonna have my birth control. I don't know if it's going to throw my body off or what's about to happen or how soon they could get me in there when the prescription is actually gonna be at the pharmacy. I don't know, but I do know I don't feel good. I don't have time for this. So I am gonna continue on with my day. Also, I don't have no Wi-Fi right now. So, um. There's an outage in my area. This is the second time this happened. There's an outage in my area today. It's like a little after 12. We won't have um, Wi-Fi until they said like after three. We won't have services. Um, <sighs> this has made me realize a lot. Um, y'all need to take them devices from y'all kids and give them other things to do because my daughter is kind of like going crazy. Well, the TV doesn't work. Um, there's nothing going on. It's just quiet in here. The iPad doesn't work. Um, nothing works. My phone is acting up. Like I can't even pull a hotspot off my phone. It's just nothing is working. We are like completely locked out. The Wi-Fi box is like off. So it's like, it just made me think like to just take the iPad away from her a little more and find other things for her to do. And even with my eight year old, just find other things for them to do because Without no Wi-Fi, everybody goes crazy because it's like you can't really do nothing without Wi-Fi. And I don't want everybody crying every time this happens or if something was to just happen where we just don't have no Wi-Fi. 
my kids, I just want them to know that they could do other things. So I want to be like more hands on with them and old school and not with these iPads and this stuff in the hand all the time. Because if something happens and there's no Wi-Fi, like I said, what the hell are we going to do? Like even us adults that work social media or do something on social media, what are we about to do? Like this just made me think today, like we just sitting here, just, just really just sitting here. It's like a punishment. So I'm going to go record my clothing haul real quick while I have time. Uh, I won't be going to the doctor today. I'll keep you guys updated on how that goes. And make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I want to welcome all my new subscribers. Welcome to my channel, guys. And don't forget, make sure you subscribe so you can enter for the 1,200 subscriber giveaway. Um, we're not that close to it, but we're getting there. So I'll keep you guys posted on how we're doing with that. All right, guys. Have a good day. <laughs> Bye. Send the best fighter for the champ. Rack, I got them. Mary, I'm popping. They keep hating, but still.